Okay. This is just brief overview of what we're doing. So we are specifically focusing on enterprise meetings. It makes you make your meetings productive, make take care of the actionables using voice. We have raised 90k in funding so far. We are a team of six guys, three co-founders. We have 15 customers as of now. We are in a private beta. We have 15 uh, paid customers. We are looking for 350k. So the problem that we're trying to solve is most of the meetings are not productive. Uh, the reason being there is a lot of talk, but at the end of it, there are very few actionables. You have to uh, physically track all those things. Remember it when you come back for the follow-up meeting. Uh, we don't know how many things are done that's pending. And $37 billion is just spent on meetings alone in the US. So we have a solution. We have built a voice-based assistant for your meetings where who you could talk to. You could assign tasks to anyone in a meeting. It'll listen to it. It'll sync with your task management tool as well. It will remind you things when you come back for the follow-up meeting. So these are the three main things that we're solving. So we have a Maya assistant that sits inside a meeting room you could talk to. You could say, hey, assign a task to uh, Nigel to complete application development. It will do that. Uh, second is you can pull data from your backend. Let's say you have your ERP like Salesforce, uh, Google Analytics. I could just ask, hey, Maya, what was the sales for the last month from India? It will fetch that data and show it on screen. Third is it keeps track of the meetings and tasks in one place. So we have an application on your phone as well, which will show you all the details. So we make use of AI and ML. Uh, so this is how uh, we help you generate automatic minutes, which is sent to everyone post-meeting. Right after you step out of the meeting, you get your minutes. Uh, it also sync with, so we have built a conversational engine, which makes these conversations happen. So the integration so far we have built is with Salesforce, Google Analytics, Asana, and Jira. These are the four integrations we have built so far. Uh, so this is how a typical interaction with Maya looks like. Uh, it also works with Alexa and Google Home, uh, but it will also work with any existing microphone that is there in your conference room. You could just connect with your uh, laptop or a mic and it'll work. Uh, but uh, it works better with a far field microphone. This is a business model. So we are looking for a SaaS model for enterprise. Uh, starts off with $89, uh, which will give you up to 50 meetings a month. And as in how you go higher, uh, the plan Im increases. Uh, we are building more integrations to make the adoption faster. Uh, so eventually, uh, we'd be doing custom integrations for bigger enterprises. Uh, the differentiation. 10 seconds. Yes. The bigger differentiation that we are offering with respect to, let's say, Amazon Echo or Google is we provide you data privacy. So we host the data at your end rather than uh, third party. Uh, that's only an option for bigger enterprise, not for SMEs. Uh, eventually, we are coming with more uh, me uh, meeting templates like a Scrum Master, review meeting, follow up meeting, eventually. Uh, this is a team. Uh, this first three as a co founders. Uh, yes, why now? Because voice technology is better now than before. So, this actually helps. I mean, this actually works right now. Uh, Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go to the QA. Yeah. Thanks for the pitch. So, so what do you think are the main reasons that uh, meetings are not productive or effective? Sure. So most of the time, uh, people don't look at the minutes before coming to a meeting because it's a piece of text, like two, three pages of document or an email. So you don't really have the time and effort to go through all those things. So that's where Maya comes in. And the moment you walk into the meeting, it gives you a brief of what happened with respect to last meeting, show all these details on the screen. It'll show you which are the tasks got complete and what is pending. So you are better informed. So we are actually solving half an hour catch up which happens currently. So that is totally avoided from every meeting that happens from now on. So that's, so most of the people are not informed. That's one thing. Second is uh, uh, it always starts late. And there is always that uh, assistant who is missing, who knows how to run a meeting. So we want Maya to be that smart assistant. Like the way smartphone makes you smarter, we want Maya to make your meeting smarter. Same thing. Yeah. Thank you. Um, and why voice? Why, why is that sort of easiest interface to sure. interact in a meeting? Absolutely. So in a meeting, you don't want to look into your phone or a laptop. You want it to be conversational based. So we felt like the uh, interactions or the effectiveness improves a lot the moment it goes to voice. And uh, we felt that that's the best way to interact in a meeting, like as if you're talking to a real person rather than looking at a device. Yeah. Thank you so much. Uh, yeah. An interesting technology indeed, and probably <laughs> very useful from my perspective today. Uh, what do you need in the next one or two years to really penetrate the market? Sure. So we are looking at more integration. So one uh, uh, problem that we found was uh, the 
once it gets integrated into a system with one click, it's much easier for you to use rather than you know doing a lot of integration. So we are adding more integrations like Salesforce, Jira, or Asana, or Trello, so that it's already part of your workflow. So you don't have to do more to start using it. So add more integrations uh, so that there's uh, improved ad adoption. And obviously, uh, evangelize a bit on voice, because it's a bit different on how you're currently running uh, meetings. So behavioral change is part of it. But yes, other than that, everything else is fine. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thanks.